I don't know why I'm like this. It's too gross. I heard it. <laughs> Ooh. I don't like it. I'm gonna have to go through everything and I do not want to do this. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ebeth and I post realistic, messy, mom life vlogs as well as detailed product reviews before you leave don't forget to hit that subscribe button we are growing in subscribers it's so exciting and it's so motivating when i see that number go up and more people engaging in the content it's so fun so thank you for subscribing and thank you for sticking around if you're an old subscriber i have a lot that i need to get done today but i also have three children and I'm also not feeling 100%, so we're just gonna do our best. <laughs> I wanna challenge you while you're watching today's video, look around the room you're in, if you're able to, if you're not like listening to this while you're driving or something or at work, um, and see if there's an area that you can tidy up while this video plays so we can clean together. It may be a pile of mail that you have nearby, a junk drawer, or maybe you are like listening to me in headphones and walking around your whole house cleaning with me. Let's do this together. Let's get some peace in our home, some more organization in our lives, and you know, do the things that we really don't wanna do. <laughs> Yesterday we had a fun little day. We went out and about all day. I think I have some footage from the park. It was super fun. I heard a baby galuga. Uncle Bubba just told me that oh, song. Oh, baby beluga. Yeah, I just Uncle Bubba told me that song, and I and and I heard it, and I heard it. When we came home. I had some more cleaning to do. And um, this morning we went garage sailing and I ended up picking up some clothes for Judah, a keyboard for the girls, a fun play dress for McKenna. Ah. Yeah. Oh, this is the thing. That's a pedal. Pedal. Ooh, pretty. But now it's time to get down to business. Oh, his little hair is so... It's so soft. Ah. First thing I need to address is the messy kitchen. I don't know why I'm like this. Because it's always a mess. Because I'm always avoiding it. If I just cleaned up after I made the mess, it wouldn't be a mess. These are my headphones from Amazon. I'll link them in the description box below. The Bluetooth. They're cute. They have great sound. I know, babe. But we're gonna, uh, I'll put on another show for you, okay? Anyways, I'm gonna put these on. I can still hear my children through them. Um, I usually like cock one ear up so I can definitely hear if anything is going on. And I'm gonna probably play some YouTube videos or podcasts. Sometimes I listen to music, it just depends on my mood. But it really helps me focus on the task at hand and it makes it more fun for me. <laughs> um, Cause I just, I just don't like doing this. I don't like it. So life hack, headphones are game changer, especially if you're cleaning in a, a space where other people are around you. It may be different if I was all alone, but with my kids or like if my husband's around and he's trying to relax, it just helps me focus and not feel that cleaning rage when I have headphones on and I'm listening to, like I said, a podcast, a YouTube video or music or something. So um, if you have cleaning rage issues, Maybe invest in some Bluetooth headphones. Or not even Bluetooth, they can just be headphones. You can just plug in your headphones and put your phone in your pocket or whatever. All right, let's clean, shall we? Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Okay, it's a few days later and now we're in the bathroom. This is the project, the spring cleaning project that I've been putting off. The countertop was just chaos. And then I'm going to show you the closet in our bathroom. It's a nightmare. So I'm going to have to take everything out of it and organize it. And uh, we're going to do this together. So here we go. Um, so I'm going to use this caddy that I have. <laughs> I was using this for like Judah's baby things, 
Evers. So I'm gonna put this like tucked away on the side here and like hide hopefully all of Angelo's stuff on that. And then mine is minimal. I'm I just I'm pretty good about putting them away when I'm done most of the time, but unless it's a Sunday. On Sundays it all just goes out the window. I can see you down again. Falling to the ground again, I feel you. Try to fight it on you. I'll help you light your fire. I'll take your hand, raise you up higher. You can dare to live. Stand up, be the hero you need, the dreamer you dreamed of. Speak up, scream in the mirror, you're free, you're free, you're free now. Light up, you can feel the heat of the spark. Alrighty. I just came from a doctor's appointment and I do not like going to the doctor at all. So I feel like an energy high because I did it, you know? So I'm hoping that accomplishing this task that I've been avoiding will also give me a nice serotonin boost, you know? I'm also drinking an iced coffee, which is helping my mood as well. I'm trying to get as much hair out of the drain as possible. And this is disgusting. I ended up using, first I ended up using my scrub, scrubber, and then tweezers to pull even more hair out. And I'm not gonna show you because it's too gross to show you. Not to say I'm ungrateful for it because I am grateful for it. It is a working shower with running water. It is, nice looking um but the water gets out of the shower easily on the floor on the walls it's just not not an ideal setup for a shower and even the drain like they didn't they did, just didn't build it properly they did it messy cheap you know what i'm saying okay y'all i am finally going to open up the messy embarrassing closet and show you what's inside. We're gonna take everything out. I'm gonna have to go through everything and I do not wanna do this. First of all, there is no light in this closet. You see how big this, this closet is huge. It is technically a walk-in closet. No lights. It's a cave. Why would they do that? That's besides the point but it makes it even harder to organize because it just feels like a cave. So then we just chuck stuff in there. Um, okay, I'm, I'm just gonna show you how crazy messy it is. Ah, here we go. You guys, you guys, oh, you guys. <laughs> we live in a new build community that was built in the last probably five years, then you may be familiar with the layout of the home that we have. Um, let me know, if you live in this same floor plan that we live in, does your closet have a light in it? <laughs> because I'm like, why? Why wouldn't they put a light in there? You can't see anything in there, let alone. I also wanna point out that my height does me no favors when it comes to organizing spaces. Let me show you, okay? I'm 4'11". 4'11". 4'11". Okay, this is the door. This is the hand. You see, you see how short I am? I can't even use the top shelf, which is why the bed sheets are just thrown up there because I literally throw them to the top shelf. <laughs> Okay, so here's the plan. I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna put a timer on the screen here and I'm just gonna play some music. So while I clean out my messy closet, while I take everything out of it, 
You guys pick an area around you that you can declutter while I declutter. Let's be productive together and let's make our home a more peaceful place. All right, you ready? On your mark, get set, go. Get our fear of what comes after we'll Hold on for better days Let our past begin to shatter This is such an accomplishment, <laughs> such a win. Oh my gosh, so I still need to like throw away my coffee and put the cleaning stuff away, but look at the countertop, wow. Also, I think I fixed my sink issue. Watch, I'm gonna run water and it goes down the drain. Look at that, wait, wait. It's going down the drain. There was a ton of hair clogged in there and I had to dig it out. It was disgusting. Um, I did clean out my cabinets under here, it's like roughly. It's still like, could use some work and that makeup bag definitely needs to be sorted through but it's a lot better. I did not go under Angelo's cabinets though. Um, of course, cleaning the shower, need to put the little tiles back on there and then bring the rugs in. This is all of the garbage that I got collected just from the bathroom. It is a massive pile of garbage. And, and in all honesty, I'm sure there's even more that I could put in there because I did not sort and go through our like little medicine thing. I didn't go through the drawers of it, um, which I need to do another day, but I just, this was, this was too much. I was overwhelmed already as is. So anyways, there's just a lot, a lot of stuff going on in here. But here is, here's what we're working with in the closet. You know, I, I did not touch the top shelf, to be honest. But everything else is like really manageable, you know, in a proper place. There's no junk just thrown about. You can clearly see what's going on and what we have. The medicine cabinet is, is accessible. It definitely needs, there's a McKinnabay. So I hope that you also, oh my God. Oh, she's so, she's so tired. Okay, go, go to your room, McKinnon. Go to your room and I'm gonna tuck you in, okay? She is crazy sleepy. Also, I think something is stuck on my teeth. I've been feeling it all day. I'm gonna use one of those floss sticks that we have like a million of. Overall, I feel so proud and accomplished. I can't believe that I finally did it. I've been putting it off for weeks. So this was a huge accomplishment. I hope that you were inspired to go and clean out or clean off that one thing that you've been putting off forever and ever and ever. You're not alone in this. We all deal with the mess okay yeah. all right i gotta go put these girls to bed make sure you're subscribed to the channel and, and i'll see you next time bye <laughs>